you can kind of hang your head on, you know, just being able to be more efficient on offense uh, this week? Um, yeah, so, I mean, when we get in our offensive meeting, we'll definitely talk about, you know, being able to how we move the ball better this week than the last two weeks. We obviously haven't played Doris in the last two weeks. Um, I mean, I feel like today we really did play Doris and We played the best ball we could besides for the third quarter. Um, I think that was kind of our rough stretch right there. But once the fourth quarter, fourth quarter came around, we kind of got back into it. But, uh, I mean, that's what, that's what it is right there, having a rough little patch in the middle of the game, I guess. What was the biggest change between the last two weeks of this week that changed, you know, to get you guys back up to the standard you want to play at? Um, kind of just, you know, getting sick of losing, you know. I mean, like I said before, coming in the season, supposedly the second toughest schedule in the country. And, you know, you're going in the bye week 6-2 and two, and then, you know, have some rough losses after our bye week. And then... Uh, you know, it's just coming coming together and having trust in one of another, and know why we're like why we're having a good season and whatnot. You, you get coach talked about not being satisfied with playing competitive, losing close game. Is there a sense of what if you know, like what if we did this or that, walking away from this game? Um, I mean, I guess so, but I guess not. Sort of say. Um, I mean, we played the best ball we could. Uh, we ended up coming short, like I said. I think we had a rough patch there in the third quarter. Um, Personally, I was out there on the punt team, and I missed I missed a call, and we had a punt block, which was a big thing in the game. And uh, you know, so it's pretty, it's a pretty tough game. Uh, early in the game, you had the high hurdle of the day. Did you actually think you were going to jump over that guy, or was that just an instinct? Uh, yeah, like I said, I mean, once I see people start ducking their heads, that they're not going to try to hit me mm -hmm. up high, and they're trying to go for my knees or something, mm -hmm. I'll just jump. Even if he clips the bottom of my leg, it's not going to hurt that much. You talked about wanting to improve your receiving ability as a tight end instead of just being a blocker to get a touchdown in this game and have the early success um, you know receiving the ball how much does that improve your confidence and, and show your ability in your development in that field um, it definitely gave me confidence in the way that uh, you know coach wants to get me the ball coach wants to get his playmakers the ball so uh, you know it's awesome that they gave me that opportunity to get the ball early in the game and have an impact in the game